it's cold out here it's monday well it's cool cutting more wood i gotta show you guys how far i've gotten on this um this is the uh the front cap i'm using cheap two by fours because i'm going to end up putting uh thompson's water seal on it that's for the front it's going to go up against the front like that and then these are the side rails that'll go along like that to boost that up they're 22 inches tall so not quite two foot but it'll be enough for me to be able to get into the back and i'll be able to stand up in there i should be able to if my calculations are correct so now we're going to take these paneling and put the paneling on these with uh some short little wood screws uh this is a six foot and a half inch and then the rails are eight foot that'll go from the front all the way to the back and uh i'm going to use these these little screws right here which these are where is it inch and a quarter just to hold the uh the quarter inch paneling on and then like i said we'll end up covering this and painting it uh white to match the truck it's not going to be pretty but it's going to be functional i don't know it might be pretty it all depends on who's looking at it so uh we're gonna get that done real quick all right now i got the walls on there over in the corners i put l brackets l things whatever in the bottom corner and the top corner to hold those corners uh square and then uh, i put self tappers going straight through the wood straight through the top of the bed i got four on this rail three on the back and four here and then I've got long wood screws going straight through here to hold the camper top on. I've got four down here and four across the front and four back over here. Uh, three inch wood screws. Oh, <laughs> it came right at me. Scared the hell out of me. I didn't know what it was. It was a butterfly. Anyway, uh, this is how weird it looks now because it's all like three tone color. Uh, once we get it done, it will be all one, one color. I still have to put uh, a bunch of uh, weather seal on it <clears throat> to get it done so that no water gets in while it's raining or while we're going down the road but uh, I found out that it's about six inches too short for me to stand straight up but that's okay it's quite all right I'm not gonna worry about that I'm sure we'll get plenty of looks out of this thing wherever we go huh think we'll get a bunch of looks mm -hmm. <laughs> but this is this is cheaper than buying a camper now I gotta put I'm gonna put a brace going straight across the rear right here so that can close because from there down I gotta put I'm gonna put the walls right here so that's what I'm building next all right here it is pretty much all the way done it's got a few more things to do to it but you can see how this is the tailgates closed there's the handles and there it is open this opening right here is four foot wide so it's just plenty to be able to get the four-wheeler up in here the handlebars might be close but we can just push them down and go in but that's how that's gonna work we've already got Katie's bed up there or storage when she's not with us and uh, we put a little lip on the outside edge of it to help for rolling off or if we have stuff up there it's not gonna vibrate out uh, we still want to put one more removable shelf down here at the bottom possibly a fold-out table on the side the air conditioning is gonna go in this left door which all I got to do is I got to figure out where exactly I want to put it and then I'll put two, two studs like that, cut the hole and the air conditioner will, will be mounted in there permanently. Uh, we still got to paint it, but I wanted to get as much done as I could this weekend. So the finished product is not all the way done. It still needs to be painted. But I see it right there. That's gonna be the end of this video. I've been working on it for the past two weeks uh little by little as much as much time as i had to be able to get it done uh, we still need to remove it one more time and slide it back 
so we can get the rest of the front of it painted and the whole top is going to get painted all white so it matches the truck thank you for watching please subscribe if you haven't subscribed already uh give us some thumbs up and uh leave uh comments in the comment section below see you guys next time